Hi, good morning everyone. Welcome again to my channel. It's me, Miss Elsa, your trainer. And today we're going to show you the steps on how to do cardiopulmonary resuscitation. Come on, let's watch together. Okay, so what is CPR? This is cardiopulmonary resuscitation. And this is a life-saving technique. When the person's heartbeat stops or there is a cardiac arrest, then the blood circulation stops, okay? And when blood circulation stops, uh, the blood going to the brain will be uh, interrupted and the brain cannot receive enough oxygen, okay? So we will do the following steps to revive the victim. The first step is you have to check if the scene is safe. Check if the scene is safe. So let's say the scene is safe, so the person was not, uh, the cardiac arrest is not caused by electrocution, okay? You go to the person and check responsiveness, okay? Tap the individual on the shoulder. Hey, 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 are you okay? The person is not responsive, so call 911. Okay, or let somebody call. If you have a companion or a bystander, you request them, hey, can you please call 911? Then go to the person and you have to check the pulsations and breathing okay how would you say check the pulsation okay do like this okay on the both sides you have the carotid artery okay then check it with feel it with your two fingers if there are pulsations it means if there is pulsations so the person is alive okay and your <clears throat> face you place it on the person's or victim's nose and mouth so that you can feel the air coming from the nose or mouth. And at the same time, you have to watch or observe the rise and fall of the chest for breathing. So let's say negative pulsation, negative breathing, proceed to compression. So we have what we call cub. Cub means compression. Okay, this is to restore blood circulation. Okay, so you have to do 30 compressions. Okay, and A is airway. So airway is you have to open the airway. Do head tail chin lift maneuver. So tilt the, uh, raise the head. Okay, tilt the yeah, the head and lift the chin. Then with your <clears throat> two fingers, close the nostrils. Then breathe from your mouth to the mouth of the victim. Okay. If the victim's mouth is seriously injured and cannot be opened, so from your mouth to the nose of the victim. Next is breathing. You breathe from your mouth to the mouth of the victim making a seal, okay? And you deliver two blows. Okay. So do this for five cycles. Five cycles means 30 compressions and two blows. That is one cycle. So do this to do this for five cycles. So 30, two, and five. Okay? Now, after the fifth cycle, you have to check responsiveness through pulsations and breathing. So the same that what you uh, did here, you place again your finger on the victim's carotid artery and also observe the rise and fall of the chest. So if there are already signs of life, like, like pulsations and breathing, then place your 
patient in a recovery position. Okay? Recovery position. So then watch or wait for the EMS to arrive. EMS is Emergency Medical Services. They have their machine called EAD, okay? Automated External Defibrillator, okay? So that is our um, CPR. How about uh, the uh, doing? Thank you for watching and please don't forget to hit the bell so that you will be notified every time I'm uploading a new video. Thank you very much and God bless.